Texas, along with 16 other states, is suing to stop President Barack Obama's executive action on immigration. Now, it comes about two weeks after the president announced the action, which includes stopping deportations for parents of U.S. citizens. The lawsuit names as defendants the United States of America, the Secretary of Homeland Security, the Commissioner of Customs and Border Protection, the Chief Deputy of the U.S. Border Patrol, and other federal officials. Abbott says the lawsuit does not seek monetary damage, but rather injunctive relief from the executive order. Now, two things are clear. Our immigration system is broken and it must be fixed. Second, the Constitution prescribes immigration policy be fixed by Congress, not by presidential fiat. Of the Department of now Abbott went on to say the president's executive action would increase the humanitarian crisis along the border and will affect increased state investment in law enforcement, health care, and education. All but two of the states included in the lawsuit have Republican governors. The state's case was filed in U.S. District Court in the Southern District of Texas. In the newsroom, Sergio Chapa, Action 4 News.